Greetings everyone, Xanrath here. Welcome to Life is Strange. And this is a new game that was actually released uh, today, uh, or at least the first episode, that is. I believe there's five episodes total, and I don't think they all have a determined release date yet, but I've heard uh, they're slated to be released like six weeks apart or something like that. Anyway, this game is developed by Don't Nod Entertainment. I believe this is their second title. Uh, it's published by Square Enix. And um, I actually don't know too much about this game other than what I saw uh, in the trailer, so good job, marketing team. Uh, but what I did see, you know, kind of really drew me in, so I'm excited to play this. Um, it's also gotten a lot of really great reviews, and I think it's won like an award or something, so, you know, it's, I think there's a lot of hype surrounding this, uh, this game's release. Um, basically, this game is a graphic adventure. Um, I don't play games of this genre, really. Uh, so I, I guess the best comparison is maybe like uh, the Walking Dead or Game of Thrones games, you know that kind of you know because it's it's episodic like those and you know it's kind of like it's more about the story, um, you know you're playing through and, and experiencing and being immersed in this story rather than you know really focusing that much on gameplay. Although there is I think more of a gameplay aspect than just simple point and click. But I don't know I don't play this genre like I said, so I'm really excited to try this out. Uh, again, this game has a lot of um, accolades, so I think it's a good one to, to jump in on. And um, just as a, uh, a, a small um, warning, I guess, maybe, uh, this is uh, rating mature. There's, like, blood, strong language. Um, I guess there's going to be some... The, the content is going to have some, some thematic stuff that, you know, maybe people won't uh, be super comfortable with, I don't know. Um, but, you know, we're all on the internet, I'm sure no one really cares, but just as a, a fair warning. Uh, basically, uh, from what I've read about this game, all I really know is that, you know, we play, uh, I think her name is Maxine, she like recently moved back to her hometown or something like that, she's in school, and I guess it's about, you know, trying to find your place in the world and um, how you fit in to, you know, wherever you are and all the kind of drama that surrounds that. Uh, there's also like a interesting mechanic that I'm not gonna touch on in this intro, just because in case you probably already know, but in case you don't, I want I don't want to spoil it. So anyway, with that said, uh, let's go ahead and actually play this game. So let's go push a button. Uh, full screen is fine. Yes. All right. Um, and so this game auto saves, so I have to worry about that. Ah, here we go. Options. Great, great play episodes. So, like I said, only one uh, came out so far. Uh, options. Let's go ahead and settings. Mess around a little bit. This stuff, I think, is fine. You know, I'm not huge, like, in terms of the, the knowledge for messing around with options, so um, this is fine, I guess. The mouse does kind of feel a little floaty. I don't, I don't know if I can fix that or not. Subtitles, of course, because, you know, Oh, so that means it's going to be voiced. That, that, that way uh, you don't have to listen to me narrate all this stuff. That's great. You guys love that. Or you love that I don't have to narrate because I'm terrible at, at uh, narrating. Oh, wait. Controls. Hold on. Um, sensitivity. There you go. Let's increase it a little bit. That feels a little bit more responsive. That's good. Key bindings? Eh, we'll keep it as is. All right. I usually don't do this uh, in the first episode, but... Okay. We got all that build up, and then we get to the actual title screen. Okay, so um, let's get started then. Life is Strange is a story-based game that features player choice. The consequences of all your in-game actions and decisions will impact the past, present, and future. Choose wisely. Oh, ho. Effects are past. I 
it here? And where is here? Wait, there's the lighthouse. I'll be safe if I can make it there. I hope. Please let me make it there. Curious what we're doing uh, in the middle of the woods at night. Oh, can I do stuff? Oh, I can. Okay, cool. We can walk around now. Um. Well, obviously we're supposed to go to the lighthouse, so let's not do that first. Check out this uh, big table. Can I go anywhere else? Nope, they really do want me to. Uh, oh, I already got that big still. Alright, that's gonna get really dizzying if I keep doing that. Maybe I should have left the mouse to get me a little lower. I didn't realize it was gonna be a. Uh, Camera controlling uh, mouse. I thought the cursor just walk around, but okay. Oh, it's one of those um, touristy things I told you about this uh, this uh, lighthouse, right? Is that a pirate? Like, you guys see that? Like, right kind of where her head, or her hand, like just below her hand right now, the little red skull. Is that is there treasure there? I want to get that treasure. Um, what is this? I don't know. Wreckage. Oh, there's another thing over here. Wow, this okay. This mouse thing is gonna get a little bit. So what does that say? Work. Blank. W something C. Chloe. Is that hashtag F? I can't even. Oh F. Okay, 2008. Check out what's over here. No. I guess we'll go straight for the lighthouse then. Oh, there's a camp going on here. Bench. Oh, cutscene. Holy shit. Maybe I'll make her language. Haha. <laughs> So famously called film little pieces of time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay. I'm in class in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. From light to shadow. Stuttering From color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black? I didn't fall asleep, and that sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arbus. <laughs> Classic there cliche, you go, Victoria. Uh, Why Arbus? You because know. of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. <laughs> she saw humanity as tortured, right? And frankly, it's bullshit. Shh, 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 shh. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. Sorry, I'm just listening to this art and lesson. any one of you could do that to me. Isn't that too easy? Too obvious? What if our oh, chose to capture okay, people at the height play. of their um, beauty? Yeah, I was kind of weird that it stuttered like that. I don't know if that's... She had a brilliant eye. Um, so, she could have taken not. another approach. Oh, I have to... Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I don't I can know. hear the class laughing at me now. That's a... It kind of looks like you're a serial murderer or something, like, planning who you want to kill. Clicky clicky. Back. I have to admit, I'm not a big fan of her work. I prefer Robert Frank. How do I? Me too, Victoria. He captured uh, the essence of post My little camera bag is battered, but still kicking. There was honesty about the economic conditions of the air, but a beauty in the struggle. You, you don't have beauty without. I a haven't beauty. kept up with my journal as much as I should. My Frank was Kerouac's photographic yeah. muse. And both were the like, great I'm still chroniclers used to this. So I click, of the 1950s. And then let go. Well, no, click and then we've all seen look. that okay. I can't look at this crap. How can Party I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I bet. I can hear the class laughing at me yeah. now. Shame, shame. Take a selfie. Capturing the romantic urban solitude of the 20th century poet. No, okay, not yet. Let's look at our pencil now, case. I should take a picture. Plus, it's perfect for my Salvador portfolio, and I have to get my daily Black selfie Kanto quota. 
He was a true oh gosh, renaissance man. And his famous self-portraits are famous. I do love my analog camera. I should take a quick picture now. And in class, the you're gonna selfie. take a selfie in class with this camera. And it's camera. a great tradition, and I okay, wholeheartedly well, fight for your it. right to self-expression. Or selfie expression. <laughs> I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry. Really? I, I, thought, that was, I thought that was a The point thing. remains that the portraiture so has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? No. Uh, well, I don't know, but I'm sure Max does. You're asking me? L let me think. Um. You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Not Louis me. Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. That girl is... Very good, Victoria. <laughs> jerk. The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. You can find out all about him in your textbook. Oh, or perfect. even online. I love reading textbooks. Oh. You guys, don't forget the Shoot. deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, yeah. don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Okay, I'm not sure if I was supposed to do something there, or if they are just giving me the option to. Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. I love kissing ass. No. Okay, anyways. Um, I don't know if I was supposed to do something and actually, like, actually do something there, because I was just too infatuated by the art lesson. So, sorry, guys. Um... Are you guys need to move? Yep. All right, let's take a look at. Is this Victoria's thing? Yep. Even her school books are gift wrapped. I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What steal is she? Notes. Fifteen years old, and people laughed. I'm gonna steal her notes, Of man. course, Victoria has to have the bestest, newest, most expensive everything. What is that? I can use it. I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. Is that the teacher? Um. Uh... Cool. Buy that. 5,300? 5, sure. It's chump change, right? Oh, I can read it. Sure. Product GRLT 64s with all the speed and power expected of the new green lit the this camera is packaged or is packed uh, with expanded features and manageability. It shoots what you want, where you want. Straight out of the camera, JPEG images already have superb quality, including a new level of depth, sharpness, and malleability. $5,299. Done. Alright, uh, talk to the lady. This other girl. What's up, Kate? Kate looks so sad and quiet today. Poor thing. Paper ball? I want the paper ball. Hi, Kate. Oh, hi, Max. Why do we look like we both haven't slept in like weeks? Um, you seem quiet today. How did I embarrass her? I'll say that then. Kate, I hope I didn't embarrass you with my lame answer. It uh, sucks to be dragged into the spotlight. Unless you're Victoria. She's got nothing on you, Max. Well, I should get going. Yeah, me too. Talk to you later. Sure. Can I look at her homework? She's doing physics. Oh, mirror equation. Nice. I love that. Tell me about your, reflect, your reflection refractions. Okay, maybe not. Paper ball? Not me. Now I wish I wouldn't have read this. Dear Purge. Kate, we love your porn video. XOXO Blackwell Academy. Oh, Blackwell is the school? Or no, XOXO Blackwell Heart Academy. Or no. 
Really? You couldn't read that? Like, you have to have a button? Ah, uh, well, might as well put it in, right? Oh! Hey, is that what the computer's for? Do we get to check out? Is it already preloaded? Kate's uh, porn video? Nice. Obviously, Blackwell spent bank on the computers here. Watch Kate's Looks porn. Looks like somebody was already working on this. Not nope, JK. Cool. Um, guess no porn for us. Too bad. Oh, look at the printer. That printer is amazing. I'd love to see how it reproduces my pictures. Oh yeah, me too. I could pump out a whole gallery show with that thing. When I don't suck. Better Someday. than me. You're pretty good. You're uh, I love seeing Mr. Master Jefferson's selfies. awesome photos on these magazine covers. Uh, read it. Pop Vine is Grunge Dead, featuring the latest works from Mark Jefferson. Ten reasons to get electronic mail. Oh. I love electronic mail. Can we shorten that to email? That'd be pretty cool. It'd be hip with the kids. I'm like running at the walls like an idiot. That was amazing when Mr. Jefferson took a class picture the first week. Even though I class. didn't want to be in the picture at all, it was fairly fucking cool to watch him at work framing us. Yeah, that, that framing. Damn, they have carbon fiber tripods here. The ball head even has a pan lock. Oh my god, god pan I'm lock. I'm such a photo nerd. Such a photo nerd. Poster. So cool to see Mr. Jefferson's actual published pictures. Gives me hope. Me too. Synapse. Mark Jefferson's noir beauty. Film versus digital? Who will win? I don't know. Internet? You tell me. Um, photo equipment. Oh. This is definitely where cameras go to heaven. Definitely. Oh man, they have those sweet ultrasonic lenses. And look at that vintage rangefinder. What? What? Alright, books. Oh, I love books. So cool that we can check these out anytime. So cool. The Decisive Moment by Henry Cartier-Bresson. That's rare. Annie Leibovitz, mad respect. The amazing Eugene Smith. Good to see Avedon among the masters. Golly, of course. Lots of people I haven't heard of yet. I guess that's why I'm here. Besides Dolly, I don't think I've heard of any of those guys. Maybe, was the guy's name Cornell? The American that first did the French guys, whatever, selfie thing? I think I've heard of him, but then again, Cornell's also very, or is it Cornelius? I, can't, I, see, I don't even know. Here's the poster for the contest. Mr. Jefferson really expects me to enter. Why? I don't know if I'm ready for my 15 minutes of infamy. It's because he sees the potential in you. Are you an everyday hero? Find out. Wait, find out. Enter to win everyday hero photo contest. Submit an image that best represents yourself or others in heroic action. Deadline October 15, 2013. Oh, it's already well past. Uh, the winner will fly to San Francisco and represent their school in the Nation Everyday Heroes competition at the, the Young Museum of Arts on October 20th, uh, 2013. You may submit one image on approval, on an approved paper for consideration for those under or 18 and under. A parent permission, a parent permission uh, form. Oh, form must be included with the image. Are we under 18? Uh, check out the TV. Oh, is this where we watch Kate's porn then? Man, he even has the best plasma HDTV for a class monitor. Can't wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy. Or Kate's porn. Sorry, Kate's porn. Um, or Kate, you're gonna be like the butt of the joke this episode. Like, the whole episode. Even in pictures, the forest around here always looks mysterious. Oh, that's why we went to the forest then. In our cliche little, uh, Oh my god, it was just a dream! Intro. Uh, look at the clock. What time is it? School's out. Um, uh, look. You can never escape the lighthouse here. That's mysterious and scary. Oh, can we go into the back room? Is this his office? Is that where you keep the porn? Take the camera. Take the camera. Whoa, Mr. Jefferson is not messing around with that monster. He probably paid 20 grand for that camera. I, was really I bet he gets pristine digital images. Pristine. But I still dig my little instant camera. Me too. I'm gonna talk to you last, because I feel like that's the, um, like, point, maybe. Uh, check out the outside. Slender Man. Nope. Um, see the ball stadium. I guess. Okay. 
Wonder why they think she did porn. Is that a, is that a thing? Itch marks. Gotta read those. Who loves who? Hmm. Huh. This might make a cool shot. Mm, totally. What does that even say? Uh, someone Amber forever. Can't even the glare. Hmm. Huh. This might make a cool shot. Mm, can't say it. Like a K or something. I don't know. What else can I look at? Mm, all right. I guess we'll talk to you. We'll talk to the teacher first, and then we'll talk to her freaking. This is ridiculous. Here, I always get so shy and nervous around Mr. Jefferson. Let's look at them first. Up, oh, can't even talk to Victoria. Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. Well, every time you she's spoken so far, she's basically been talking smack about you. What's your shirt say? It's a doe. Anyways, let's speak to Mr. Jefferson. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson. Can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Of course. Um, do I have to? Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Mm. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? Right. But you do have a gift. Thank you. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the so age. that's what this game is about, finding our courage, being confident in ourselves so that we can share our gift with the world, share our talents, and realize that um, we can be something more in life than just random student. How cute I looked yet. Find I was meaning about in our, to. In our, in our actions. You always look Welcome always to the real world. Oh. Just cute. Hot. Hot. Then I might send you a special Here's picture. picture. Ooh, Snapchat. Because Max wants everybody to I'm see how cute she is. plays it so sharp. <laughs> I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. You get some sleep, that'll help. She's so fucking shy. She takes selfies with a standard camera. Conveniently, we can't hear anyone anymore. I mean, I don't really listen to the latest Taylor Swift album. Wait, she's not country anymore. Never mind, take it back. I was sending that statement. Don't text and drive. Life is strange. Oh, that was the preface. Episode 1 Chrysalis. So that fits with the whole thing about, you know, um, finding our courage, finding our confidence. You know, we're gonna, we're gonna work as a butterfly. Oh, it's me. Okay. What's up? Alyssa is always texting, but she doesn't hang out with a lot of people. That's a statement about how, uh, how technology has brought us all closer, but really has pushed us further apart. Yeah. Yeah. Evan doesn't say much to me, but... His photos are very cool. I don't have anything to say about that. Oh, we gotta look at the other people back here. The freaking, like, I don't know, gossipy girls. Oh, missing person. Oh, there's so much stuff to look at. I feel like I'm gonna make this game, like, drag out way longer than it's supposed to be. Just, like, looking at everything. But I think that's the point, right? You gotta experience everything. Courtney. What's Courtney? I think that's Courtney. She's such a slave to Taylor and Victoria. Oh, so I guess like she's like, she's like, uh, she wants to be cool and all that stuff, and so she hangs out with the cool kids. But we're gonna like, screw her and, and use her to like do whatever the hell they want. There's Taylor, always waiting for Victoria. Always. Science room. Oh, we can go inside. Let's look at the poster first. These missing persons posters are popping up everywhere. All right, uh, I don't have to read. Uh, or quick hitter, I can read it. Uh, missing from Arcadia Bay. Date missing Monday, April 22nd, 2013. Age 19. Oh, so we're in college. Maybe. Eh. Height 5'5", five five, weight 110, blonde hair, hazel eyes, tattoo on the calf of a dragon, and a star on the inside of a left wrist. Oh, okay, I was like, hopefully not inside of the left thigh. 
They say that there's risk. Um, unless there's additional information that you can know. Alright. 555. All fake numbers always start with 555. I think that's a history. Poster. Oh, no. On that one. I shouldn't be so stingy with my blood. Uh, blood. Give it up. Blackwell Academy needs fresh blood. Mm. Eternal Halloween Blood Drive on October 31st, 2013. Best cost wins a prize. 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. at Blackwell Gymnasium. Cool. Science room. I like science. Ah, oh, the science room. Here's the portal to Warren's brain. I guess we can't go inside. Herman, JK. JK, JK. Alright, so we talked about those guys. Let's go check out the um, poster. Bully free. Oh, bully people. It's not yes, nice. this poster must stop bullies dead in their tracks. Can I check out this piece of paper? I guess I can't. Uh, Stella. Stella is always deep in her notes. She didn't come to Blackwell to mess around. I guess we're like in an art academy. Uh, go Bigfoots. Oh, we're Blackwell Bigfoots. Bigfoots. That's cool. Don't smoke. If you care, don't. Something, something. That's Dana talking to... I think his name is Justin. Well, you guys must be... Dana is on my floor, too. She's such an archetypal, gorgeous cheerleader. They must make them in a factory. I shouldn't be so catty. Dana is nice to me. That's good. That's nice. Justin must not be important if uh, if his little description was, oh, he's talking to, to Dana. Alright, Brooke. I've seen Brooke hanging out with Warren. She seems like his type. Ah. Let's do it then. I got your back. I hate bully jock straps like Logan. And he's a Vortex Club member. Don't know what that means. Can you like wanna like nope? Alright, cool. We're moving on. To all the way we got here. Can't do those same things before. Another missing person. Same person. Um, can't remember her name, but she's right by. It looks like she's been yep. gone for months. Rachel, that's right, Rachel Amber. Oh, did she maybe go to the White House that we're trying to find her? Oh, hey. Wait, I want to examine you. Get back! No, you walk too fast. I'm like getting way turned. Okay. I'm getting way turned around. Maybe I should. I, I think I should turn up the sensitivity. Can I? Um. Okay. Just so I don't spin around so crazy. Crazily. Alright. Done. Back. Checkpoints. Oh, there are checkpoints that I have to meet? Oh, it's gonna be like when I played a bird story and I like. Oh man, that sucks. Um, okay, well, whatever. Uh, how to play? Really? That's fine. I got this. Uh, back. I wish October would last forever. Me too. I wish October would last forever. Oh. Heh. For sale. Don't need a PC, missed the Poetry Jam tryouts, and I did not steal that backpack. Huh? Oh, just think about the posters. Alright, let's take them all. Uh, rewards, September 16th, my backpack with all my school books, my new tablet was taken from the cafeteria. After I left it on the table, I really need the stuff for school. My tablet has very, my tablet has a lot of personal, very personal pics of my late cat Rip. So I'm willing to pay small cash board. Not much to ask. If you have any detail, I'll like confess. You know, uh, you know who and where I am. Word up. Blackwell Poetry Jam tryout. Yeah. October fifth, three fifteen. Main library. Be there. Uh, BC fully loaded. Six hundred dollars or best offer. Contact Mindy at blackwellacademy.com. Not ED, not EDU. Oh, that's cool. That's, right that's so messed up. I should contact them to find out what I can do. As if I am. Um, say about Kitty Bay over the past decade, climate change, alter Oregon coast. Oh, we're in Oregon. Okay. I'm actually from Oregon. Or at least I was born in Oregon. So. Uh, including fish and fauna, this has helped decimate uh, state's fishing industry, especially Arcadia Bay. Oh, I think, is this a real place? It kind of sounds like. I don't know, I was really young when I moved away. Uh, raise your voice against pollution, save your restaurant town, don't let your town down. Oh, it's so funny because it rhymes. That's how you remember it. 
Um, poster again. Just I wonder what actually I don't know why happened. You're looking at the same one. Machine. Oh, great snacks. Let's get some snacks. They should just call it a sugar machine. That would be awesome if you put money in there and a bag of sugar dropped out. <laughs> Pure on a decoration. Can we um, pick up the trash? That's been like you know decoration. You can never have enough ghosts and skeletons in the hall. Not at all. I kind of feel like the bathroom is a checkpoint, so I'm going to get to the bathroom. Good thing I'll... I left my AK at home. Oh yeah, good thing. I never take my AK to school. It's, uh, it's a little old hack. We'll get to the bathroom, and then we'll uh, go to the men's bathroom. And then we'll American go in there. Uh, poster, I don't care about this one. Oh, I can hardly wait. Never be too cool like Nathan and Victoria. Lame. The vortex got coming soon, really. Okay, cool. Uh, subject. There's Hayden, another Vortex Club bro. But he's actually not an ass. What do you even do? It doesn't even say what it does. It says something like the Vortex Club. Uh, principal's office. What's up? Uh, Ray Wells? Principal doesn't come out of his office much. It's because you're watching uh, kids porn. Ha <laughs> ha! Jokes. Miss Grant is a great science teacher. The best. How many students ever actually memorize all this shit? Uh, let's find out. We all should these days. I'll be the first. Computer lab. S13. S12. Nope, JK. Uh, uh, left mouse button to go to the camp. Oh! Wait, what? Oh, uh, like I need to go splash some water on my face and brush it out first. Okay. That last. Look at the lighthouse. There's the lighthouse again. Yeah. Poster. Wish, uh, wish I told her whatever happened. Yay, Halloween. Oh. My favorite time of Got year. me. The Bigfoot stomp. I should develop some school spirit. Go team. I love how she's just like, go team. Join chess team. What's up, uh, dude? He's cute. I like skater boys. Too bad they don't like me. He's a scare boy. It's because he has a beanie. Is that it? Well, now we know what type of uh, guy he looks like. Uh, Zachary. Figures Juliet would be dating Zachary. Jocks sucked up in the Vortex Club. Is that the, uh, the There's dude, Juliet from my dorm. Yet another Vortex Club disciple. That's the one I do. Join just yet. Yeah. Nerd alert. This poster has Warren written all over it. All over it. That's what I thought it was Not there yet, though. I'm gonna check out the stairs. Okay. No stairs for us. Okay, well, I think that's everyone. Or less of people who like walk too fast for me to interact with. So, bathroom time. <laughs> that's like the longest it took for anyone ever to get from a classroom to the bathroom. Alright. Gonna happen to that. There's Empty. probably good. Nobody can see my meltdown except for me. Oh, we're gonna freak, freak out. Huh? <sighs> Something's gonna happen in the stalls. I'm guessing. So it's in the stalls. Oh, my time. I get to do stuff. Uh, graffiti. Now, who would bother to write that crap? Rachel Amber is a bitch. And then she went missing. How uh, suspicious. Mm-hmm, cleaning stuff. Fire but ooh. Do we get to, nope, just looking at it. I remember when somebody punked the alarm last month. At least I got out of science class for that quiz. Punked? Is that really a thing? I hate Victoria Chase, me too. Uh, Illuminati, confirmed. This poster must drive people to have sex. Abstinence makes the heart grow fonder. You can still love and learn without sex. Time is on your side. So is common sense. Use it. Kate twerks for God. Is that what her porn is about? Twerking for God? Okay. Can you can you swim to success? I don't know. Tampon. Is, oh, I want that. I'm good to flow. Thanks. Mm, so that people do people say that? Vortex Club are f jerks. Yeah, exactly. Hello. Um, uh, use poster. Oh, there it is. I can use that one. The last time I got a flu shot, I got the flu. Fuck you. Mm, 
yeah, you know, flu is not always, uh, it's productive, it's not always going to be 100%, but usually do pretty well on it. Get the flu before the flu gets you, get immunized today. Alright, I guess we're going to look at ourselves with a mustache and a crown. Turn around, go. Use the mirror. I feel like the universe is taunting me everywhere I go today. It all started with that bizarro dream in class. Am I going crazy? Alright, now we use the faucet. Someone's gonna jump out and not stall behind us, huh? Always check the stalls. Always check the stalls. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. In more ways than you know. Fuck it. Oh no. That was a terrible tear. Not even down the middle. Butterfly. When a door closes, a window so opens. Symbolic of. Or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. Butterfly. Let's look at it first. Whoa, where did that butterfly come from? The it window. doesn't look like any kind I've ever seen before. The blue, blue wings are practically glowing. Oh. I, I can almost feel the air moving around me. The butterfly feels almost like a spirit. Mm. Let's take a picture of it then. Capture its soul. Oh, we scared it. It's not even on the picture. <gasps> no, it's on the picture actually. Oh, someone's in here. Is that a guy? Uh oh. Someone it's gonna ignore that abstinence sign. Don't stress. You, you're okay, bro. Just come to three. Oh, he's freaking out. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. You're the boss. Great pep talk. So what do you want? Huh? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step ass would say. Now, -ass. let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. Hella. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. Oh. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am oh. or who you're messing around you with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Oh, right. Come on, put that thing down. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh. No! Freaking out, man. We're on drugs here. Why did you drop the gun when you shoot? Oh! Whoa. Crazy. What the fuck? How? How can that be? What the fuck indeed? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. Shot her. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. These pieces of time. How would that have happened? I, I don't know. But I saw the little save thingy. So I'm gonna call it from there because I can pick it up from that last checkpoint. Anyway, so far, um, you know, it's, um, Art Student Simulator 2015. I don't know. It's, it's, it's been, it's interesting so far. I think, I think we're just brushing the surface. It's going to get much more in depth, depth, um, after we kind of get some of that story out of the way. But no, I'm, I'm enjoying it. So, um, I hope you guys are too, and, uh, we'll see what else happens next time. Uh, until then, thank you for watching. Bye.